see as i explained that the http and https both are totally different technically both are different because http can go to one folder okay and https can go to another folder so it can render two different files okay so according to our architecture both are coming to the same folder okay so when both are coming to the same folder then the index.html file that you have is basically same for both of them if you add a meta tag for index.html it will be available for this as well as this so it can create a problem so doing at this level is a little difficult okay because we are not passing it through php or we are not passing it through any of the uh, logical layer it is directly processed okay as it is whatever the html file is there as it is it is shown okay now then how do we tackle it now how many robots.txt files can be here in this folder public underscore html folder mm -hmm. only one can be there so how will you tackle it then what you need to do is you need to do a rewrite rule okay so how do you need to do a rewrite rule what you need to do is you need to say rewrite condition okay so in rewrite condition what you need to specify is your server port that server port is there okay if server port is 404443 okay right that is your secured layer port if this is there then if somebody is requesting for robots.txt take it from a different robots.txt okay instead of like robots.txt will not take his its content from robots.txt but it will take it from say robots-ssl.txt or any other stuff okay so in that way when somebody is accessing https slash slash debt consolidation care.com slash robots.txt they will get the different uh, robots.txt so in that way all the files under that will be blocked okay so no file will be rendered so once you're doing it things will be done okay this is the number one thing that you need to do second thing is remove one of the https using your webmaster tool mm. and see whether it is getting removed or not mm. if it is getting removed then you start removing in in uh, blocks like take say 100 uh, https files that are cached remove it then 100 then 100 in that way don't do it for all right okay right. do it in blocks so that we don't take that much risk because i don't know uh, how stable is basically this Google's algorithm and all? Okay, so you do like that. That will take care of this duplicate content problem. Okay, and keep a watch whether the right robots or TXT is rendered or not. And al another thing with robots or TXT is when you are doing this robots or TXT, make sure the header of robot or TXT is right. Okay, I have made a blog post on my blog that is basically about. Uh, mm, I don't remember the exact title that we have. It was about. Uh, some problem with robot.txt we had a problem with robots.txt because it was not passing the right type okay. it was not taken as dot you know the Usually. plain the, the plain slash text okay. it was not passing that uh, file type okay. and because of that they were not able to read it properly okay. and then our, all the files all the cached files went out and then when, when we corrected our robots.txt everything came back so you need to make sure that this is processed in the headers are going right Okay, so you need to check the headers also. Right. That's it. Thanks.